the person who made Kim Jong-un ignore COVID-19 to attend the funeral. A large number of North Koreans, including leader Kim Jong-un, attended a funeral for a top official. State media reported Monday, as the country maintained the much-disputed claim that its suspected coronavirus outbreak is subsiding. Since admitting earlier this month to an outbreak of the Omicron variant, North Korea has only stated how many people have fevers daily and has only identified a few of the cases as COVID-19. Its state media said Monday that 2.8 million people have fallen ill due to an unidentified fever, but only 68 of them have died since late April, an extremely low fertility rate if the illness is COVID-19 as suspected. The official Korean Central News Agency said Kim attended the funeral Sunday of Hyun Chul He, a Korean People's Army Marshal who played a key role in grooming him as the country's next leader before Kim's father, Kim jong Tu, died in late 2011. In what was one of the country's biggest state funerals, since his father death, a bare-faced Kim Jong-un carried Hyun's coffin with other top officials who were mass before he threw earth to his grave with his hands at the National Cemetery. Kim and hundreds of masked soldiers and officials also deeply bowed before Hyun's grave. State TV earlier showed thousands of other masked soldiers clad in olive green uniforms gathered at a Pyongyang plaza, taking off their hats and paying a silent tribute before a funeral limousine carrying Hyun's body left for the cemetery. Kim often arranges big funerals for late senior officials loyal to his ruling family and shows a human side in a possible bid to draw the support of the country's ruling elite and boost internal unity. That's it for today. Thank you so much for listening. Goodbye and see you in the next videos.